Good afternoon and welcome to Sandy Land Shepherd Center News. We're broadcasting on Cable Channel 3 and on sandylandcenter.org, our website. Today is Monday the 4th of March. I'm Ron Colbert and I'm filling in for Jim Lakey who's out being ill. Today the temperature is going to get up to 45 degrees and tonight's low is going to be 25. They're predicting some evening or afternoon showers but it sure doesn't feel like it. But we'll see if they've got anything happening for us. Uh, uh, tomorrow is going to be 42 and 22 for the low and sunny. Wednesday, 47 and 30, mostly sunny. Thursday, are you ready for this? 61 for the high and 38 for the low and sunny. And then we have the best of it. For Friday, 66 and 47 and sunny. Uh, for those of you who uh, are interested, I uh, looked on the city website today and they do have the new agenda up there so you can check that. They also have some uh, notes up there about some uh, jobs that they have available. They're taking bids for contract mowing. Those bids will be closing today, I mean uh, tomorrow at 5 p.m. They also are accepting applications for pool manager and lifeguards. Uh, those are uh, ongoing and you can get that information at the city office and the mayor has issued this year's burn proclamation which allows you to burn uh, leaves and stuff in your yard you need to call dispatch before you do that and the burn proclamation runs until April the 30th uh, the regulations on that I guess are you're not supposed to start before an hour after sunset, you can't add anything to the pile for two hours before, I mean after sunrise, and two hours before sunset you can't add anything to it. Uh, but it sure is nice to be able to clean up your yard and get things going, and, uh, but I definitely recommend you call dispatch and let them know what's going on so you don't have to visit with our EMS and fire department. Uh, as everybody I'm sure is aware, state basketball tournaments going on, the girls have uh, are proceeding to state as well as the boys. The girls will be playing Wednesday at 4.45 at center and the boys will be playing on um, Thursday at 6.30 at Burton. Uh, there'll be a pep rally on Tuesday at the school at 7 o'clock. Uh, it appears that the uh, Recreation Commission has chartered a bus to go to these things and if you're interested in uh, uh, joining them on the bus or anything of that nature for more information call the rec commission at 6549. Tonight uh, there'll be a board of education meeting so uh, our volunteer Carol will be taping that and then of course we've got the city tomorrow night at uh, uh, and then uh, the county on Wednesday. I want to talk to you folks out there because, you know, a lot of you don't, I sure realize it, but the television station's essentially three people. And we occasionally get tired. And it sure would be nice if people would come in and help us and volunteer to do some of this video. Because we do the county commissioners every week the city council two times a month, the board of education once a month, and it just, you know, occasionally you want a vacation. So if anybody's out there that would care to come in and help, would go to the meetings once in a while or schedule in and run the camera for us, we would most assuredly appreciate that. Uh, as to birthdays, uh, today, Becky Thrasher's birthday. Happy birthday, Becky. Tomorrow, Destiny Johnson's birthday and Kirby and Leah Christman's anniversary. On Wednesday is Jan Zimmerman's birthday, and Thursday it looks like Mark Bryant's birthday. So, happy birthday to you folks, and happy anniversary to the Christmas. We hope you folks have a really, really good time on your birthday, and especially on your anniversary. Remember, anniversaries are to remind you why you got married in the first place. Uh, I only have one menu for you today. That is here at the Sunflower Senior Center. Uh, right across the street from the county annex and every day they have a nice meal and they have good fellowship and friendship and it's just a really good thing. Uh, so they do this year round and it's just a really nice thing for the seniors. They're, 
Uh, today they'll be eating meatloaf with baked potatoes, and tomorrow is Swiss steak and buttered corn, and Wednesday is pork chop with mashed potatoes and gravy. That's really all the news and announcements I have for you today. The word of the day is this. It would be nice if we could forget our troubles as easily as we forget our blessings. This is Ron Colbert, hoping you have a great day, and we'll talk to you soon. Hello again. We just got the information from Maxville. The Maxville VIP Center's uh, covered dish and supper will be Tuesday, March the 12th at 6 p.m. Their uh, food for this week, as we were talking, uh, Shep, uh, the uh, Sunflower Center here is a good place. Well, the VIP Center over in Maxville is the same thing. It's a good place for people to come together, have a nice meal, have a little uh, uh, social interaction, and it's really a good thing. Today, over in Maxville, they'll be having chicken parmesan, tomorrow's barbecued beef, Wednesday's pork cutlets. And I'm not going to tell you any more than that. You'll have to tune in on Friday to get the, or I mean on Wednesday to get the rest of the menu. Everybody have a great day.